What's up guys, you already know what it is, the new patch just came out today and I'm just so excited to see the King and Armor King buffs that we've been waiting on for a, a whole year. A whole year. Let's see what they gave us guys, let's go. So patch 5.00 is out and um, I'm not too impressed with it, you know, as far as, you know, being a King and Armor King main. Uh, it's... it's like they got almost nothing. They chose this move here to be King's um like new wall property move or whatever it is, whatever it's called. I don't even know if it's been officially named yet. It's um pretty um like whack because uh I was already thinking, you guys, you know, we watched the trailer at Evo. I was thinking, you know, yes, it's time for some, you know, some cross-ups or <laughs> something like that. Because the characters are, you know, renealing, so I thought that I'd be able to like do a drop kick cross up or you know, body splash cross up. But they they chose the one move that puts King grounded, and it's a high. Well, he has two of them that are high and puts himself grounded. Which I mean, it could have been that. That would have been a little bit better because um, this move currently has like you know zero use. If they were gonna put like a move that does that, that puts them grounded, I would have preferred that. If it's gonna be a high, because this isn't reactable, it's faster. I don't know the exact frames, it's not 13, obviously, because he has to take that little step first, but unfortunately it's, it's the deadly boomerang and um, it's, it's, I just, I just don't care for it. Um, <laughs> let me show you guys, let me show you guys. Um, so, what's the put king at plus uh, 21 or 23? It can it can vary, you know, depending on um, how far away they are from the wall. So let me have them um, like approach just a little bit, put it back on guard, and do it here plus 28. So as you guys already know, like um, you know the, the the common sense thing, you know, your mash get up kick is uninterruptible. Unsized steppable is a real 50 50. 19 frames a piece. However, um, very punishable. You know, the opponent blocks. You know, King gets back 2 1 here. Other characters get, you know, bigger punishes. And obviously, negative 17, the low. It is going to launch, so um, let me just show you guys. I'll just have it on neutral guard here. So he can launch and you know he can get stuff like this or he can you know do the 2-2 two -two into a you know unblockable setup if it works. <laughs> you know, perfect time to jump over and do that kind of tech or whatever is that's cool stuff. And obviously, you know, the mid here, if they um actually get hit by it here. Yeah, something something whack like that, you know. It's, it gives them a little bit of a combo on either end if they get thrown. But the problem with it is that um, it's 30 frames. Daily Boomerang, it's it's very slow. It's very telegraphed. He has to do a, a minor sidestep before he does it. Highly, highly reactable. And if it misses, then he's on the ground. He's going to get hit for free. I guess it's okay that the opponent's back is still going to be towards the wall even after they punish him, but he'll definitely be at a disadvantage, you know, getting hit would suck if, you know, Kazuya or Devil Jin Duck they got their little ground scraping back four or four, four, or four, and, you know, you got to deal with the Oki from that. But, yeah, this is um pretty useless, I would say, unless you're fighting against someone with, like, zero reactions and they can't see this move and duck it. But no, I don't I don't really see it being great. And like if you don't want to take a risk, then you can you can um get up and while standing four before they do anything. So um that's an uninterruptible and Yeah, you see? Trying to sidestep here. Oh, 
Okay, okay. Yeah, I'm trying to mash down jab. Seems like that trades. It just depends on how close you are. And like you can like trade. It's just it's it's not it's not good. <laughs> I'm trying to think of a single reason why you would use like deadly boomerang at the wall compared to the actual wall splats. Or even like near the wall. Because King's forward two. Like four two one, uh one plus two one, like actual wall bounce moves that are better. There's no point. I can see if it was like, uh, you know, dragging off his 4-4-3. Yeah, moves like that that make the uh, animation happen. It's like a homely move. It's a good move that he would use anyways. And it's like unseeable. You can't see dragon off 4-4-3. But with King, they, they gave him like the worst move ever. <laughs> so yeah, this is this is no good. This is no good. Uh, it's, it's useless, so... I don't I don't really see any reason to ever use that when he has mids that do the same thing you know he's got you know exploder does really good damage on hit mid has slight tracking and on block it's a it's a safer 50 50 whereas you know that from from this you know you're, you're face down feet towards launch punishable get up low Negative 14 mid, it's, it's just not worth it. So, um, yeah, yeah, this is not a good, um, the patch was not really good to King. I guess it's good that we got to keep the, uh, burning knuckle setups and everything, but yeah, that new wall mechanic is, um, yeah, not good. Not good for King. And next we have Armor King here. His, um, wall mechanic and single buff is this move here while standing two. Um, I think this is actually a nerf if I'm not mistaken. Actually, yeah, this is a nerf because of the, the pushback on hit. Yeah, I believe it was plus six before. Correct me if I'm wrong in the comments, but uh, yeah, I think this was plus six on hit with like little pushback. Now they fly away, you know, to incorporate for the new, the new wall mechanic here. Where, you know, plus 18 and he can do whatever, but on block is, is still negative nine. So um, I don't know. Would have preferred a, a different attack. I don't know exactly what attack it could have been to like replace, but um, yeah, I, I do not know. Like I, I guess they went with the safest bet with with this here. It's a very random attack, right? Super random. But it's good that you know on counter hit he still he still gets the combo because if he if he didn't yo that would have been a mega nerf. But um, yeah, it's not too good, not too good. It, it's better than Kings though. It's definitely better than Kings because then he can start to you know go for some sort of a uh, mix up here, cross dash multis, um, low of choice, pretty much will be uninterruptible if if it's done like further away. You know, at least uh, down three, stuff like down four or one, they have to guess. But it's nothing devastating for the character. It doesn't just buff him to the moon. Because if you're going to duck and hit somebody with something at the wall that's safe, um, <laughs> duck into 442. Like, why, why wouldn't you use 442 here? You know? Less negative has a um a pretty far um like wall stick here still gets a shoulder even if they like hit the wall really late and if they're close then your wall stunts so um yeah i don't i don't i don't know about that armor kings is not um it's not really good just like king so at the very least we still got this good low <laughs> we still have the the buffs from season four it's just that the new wall mechanic is just not in his favor. Like if you if you're thinking about doing wild standing two, then you can always just do four four two. <laughs> just do four four two, get the wall stick, get the combo, be on your merry way. <laughs> Cause uh, yeah, this this is no good. Yeah, it's uh pretty much a, a nerf. 
in the open, like open field. Like I said, it's just, you know, it's plus six, they're, they're so far away, a lot of stuff is going to miss. Let's see if four or two misses here. Yeah, if they back dash, they're just out of range for everything. My goodness. Shoulder even? Even shoulder. Back three? Yeah. Yeah, you have to do something like that. So it's um not not good for Armor King either. It's better than Kings though, but still not good for either character. Yeah, that's yeah, they lost guys. They lost in this patch. <laughs> Which means we lost. Anyways, I'm going to uh, cover some of the other changes for like the other characters. I'm definitely going to address like how like certain characters got nerfed really hard, and some that should have been nerfed also didn't get nerfed. So yeah, definitely look forward to that video in the future, guys. And um, if you like the video, like, subscribe if you haven't already, and uh, stay tuned for the next video. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.